The Insight Strategist Solutions Africa study was conducted between 29th April and 3rd May 2019 and sought views from Kenyans on a number of national issues. More than 1,700 of the respondents across 38 counties were involved in the survey done through face-to-face -face interviews. The poll focused on the strength of presidential candidates, popularity of presidential running mates, and the fight against graft. 30.81% of those conducted indicated they will vote in Deputy President Dr. William Ruto as president. 27.5% preferred ODM leader Raila Odinga, while Nairobi Governor Mike Sonko coming third with 12.8%, ahead of Amani National Congress leader Salim Davadi, who garnered 9.3%. Others are Kalonzo Musioka, who got 8.5%, Gideon Moy with 2.7%, and Governors Alfred Mutua and Hali Asan Joho getting less than 0% each. But it's not all smiles for the deputy president, since 14% of Kenyans are yet to make up their mind. With that high number of undecided people, then uh, you see uh, uh, Honorable Ayla is the second one from that sample. There is a possibility of those undecided voting for each or either of those candidates. The poll also shows that Odinga and Ruto are still holding their blocks tight at 66% and 65% in Nyanza and Rift Valley respectively ahead of the 2022 elections. The research revealed that Kenyans feel Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi is the suitable running mate rated at 22% followed closely by Governor Kivuta Kibwana at 18%. Dr. Fred Matiangi is the first person who is most likely to be voted as a learning mate, followed by Kibuta Kibwana, followed by William Kabogo, Mwangi Weiria, Anne Weigoro, Wikiri Paranya, Justin Mutuli, Speaker and Amazon King. Despite constant raids by the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission on politicians alleged to have committed economic crimes, Kenyans still believe the commission is not doing enough in the fight against corruption. 42% think the Directorate of Criminal Investigation is the most proactive institution in the fight against graft, followed by the Directorate of Public Prosecution at 40%, while ESCC is last at 7%. The public think that uh, this year is more fighting corruption than any other institution with a 42.6%, DPP followed by DPP with 40.4%, then Judiciary with 9.3%, and the EACC is the last one. The research firm also shows that a majority of Kenyans are pushing for the constitutional amendment, with 79% of the respondents saying yes to a referendum, 17% saying no, and 5% not sure. Victor Wanaswa Switch TV.